Can you save yourself from max height using the new Ice Mythic? Here we go. I'm dropping. I'm dropping. Oh, man. I feel like it works. Today, we're busting season four myths. Let's go. Can you shockwave someone who's mid rocket ram? Toss. Oh, we set him flying. Can you launch yourself using the new ice wall mythics in a car? I'm going to hop in. Use it on the car. Oh, my God. Am I going to fall to my death? Oh, okay. Okay. You got to catch yourself with something, but that was crazy. Is there a zip line that teleports you near Mega City? Okay, so I heard that this zip line right here, you actually skip the whole animation and end up on the other side. And yes, what was that? In the trailer, the ice wall stops a Deku smash, but does this actually work in game? All right, I got the ice wall up. Wait, it actually does. And it also makes you slide with ice on your feet. Interesting. There's a vault key card from a different POI. Open all the vaults. So I have the Rumble Ruins vault key card right here. I'm going to try to open Eclipse's state with it and see if it works. No, it doesn't. This used to work in other seasons in the past. Can two rocket rams collide midair? Charge up. You do collide and damage each other, but you don't actually bounce off of each other. All right, going up in the air, dropping down. Rocket Ram coming up. Oh, wait, dude, I'm flying. Oh my God, this does work, but you have to go from up to down instead of straight at each other. Myth confirmed. Can the Rocket Ram make you invincible against the Deku Smash? Honestly, I don't think it's going to work. The Deku Smash is pretty OP. Wait a minute. I just ate that Deku Smash for breakfast. What was that? Okay, this is crazy. Did they nerf Chun-Li in season four? Everyone in my chat is telling me that if you pickaxe the vault with Chun-Li, she's been nerfed. What does that even mean? Here's the vault. Pickaxe. Hey, yo, what? <laughs> what is going on there? Why is it deflating? Myth confirmed, I guess. What? Okay, so now for an actual important one. Did you know you can thunder pump with the rocket ram? So if you time things perfectly right as you land, if you swap to your shotgun, you can immediately shoot with your shotgun and get a double hit, the ram and the shoddy shot. Can your teammate launch you with a new ice wall? Yeah, it definitely works. Can you farm infinite gold with the EMP grenades? And I have the answer right here. You absolutely can. When you throw EMPs at the vending machine, it's going to spit out gold. You can just keep doing this over and over until you run out of EMPs. And it's honestly a really great way to get gold up. Can you animation cancel the end of the rocket ram explosion? If you land and immediately start sprinting or swap to your weapon, you can start shooting instantly to catch people off guard. Now for the real important myth. His name is Fish Thick, but is Fish Thick Thick? Oh, man, what is that? That's a pancake right there. I don't know, man. We might have to revoke your title. Does the drum gun have zero plot time? Yeah, for some reason in the most recent update, Epic broke some of the weapons and now they have no pullout time. So the drum gun just got a buff. And it looks like with the SMG, it really shakes your screen for some reason. I don't know if this is intended. Are there OP bushes at Sanguine Sweets? And... The answer is yes. These bushes look like they can be farmable, but they're not farmable. You can just hop inside them and hide. So if you ever catch yourself needing a place to get away, these bushes are perfect. If you have the rarity check perk, can you heal off an NPC? All right, we got the rarity check. And yeah, you absolutely can. Can you slide under a truck? Here we go. And slide. Wait, you, you can, but you do take a little bit of damage. Does the EMP work on a car? All right. It does. It completely stops the car and there's a disabled icon that actually comes up. Can a turret save you from fall damage? All right. So we used to do this back in the day in chapter three. Throw the turret, hop on top, and we're going to cut this out. And if we fall with the turret, we don't take fall damage. Myth confirmed. Can you double pump with the new sticky grenade launcher? All right, I got two sticky grenades, and yes, you absolutely can. And this is so OP. And honestly, you could even go with three or four sticky grenade launchers if you really want to ruin someone's day. Myth confirmed. Now, you know we have to try this. Can you fish using a rocket ram? 
I'm guessing that this is gonna work because most things that explode allow you to fish. And yeah, you absolutely can. Well, I guess we also have to try the new items. Can you fish with the EMP nade and sticky launcher? I'm assuming you can, because you can pretty much fish with anything and the nade definitely works. And the sticky launcher, here we go. It works. Can you use a hop flower to boost your ram? So if you time the jump perfectly, you should be able to go up. And with the ram, this... Okay, this is definitely a combo. We're definitely going further, but it's not too crazy. But what about a crash pad junior? Here we go. I feel like I'm just going to break right through this. Nope, it just ignored it. Honestly, the crash pad junior is a little underwhelming. Does an EMP cancel a rocket ram? I don't think an EMP is going to stop a rocket ram. No, it still hits them, but it doesn't cancel it. Does an EMP stop a capture point? No, but how about a loot drone? Seems less likely. Oh, it does drop it. Okay. Does the turret stop tracking you if you're covered in mud? All right. This will be really big if true. It's locking on. Covered in mud and it's still locking on. What if you're hiding in a bush? All right. They're in there and the turret can't seem to find them. I mean, this is pretty accurate. Can you get free guaranteed damage by using the sticky launcher? So if we time this right, right as it blows up, you can pump them even before they build. Myth confirmed. Can you damage yourself with your own turret? Okay, so this is going to lock on to one of you guys. But what if I stand in front right as it's about to shoot? <laughs> no, I can't damage myself. Good to know. Is the red eye and the thunder shotgun still in game? Uh, people said if you kill the diamond NPC here at Mega City, she drops the red eye and thunder shotgun. And Epic keeps making this mistake and it is still in game. Interesting. Can you break the game with the ice walls? I'm going to enter this porta potty and ice wall at the same time. <laughs> that was really glitchy, but uh, I think I'm okay. Can you rocket ride with the sticky grenade launcher? All right. Oh, it looks like it just sticks to the bottom of his foot. So you can't. Makes sense, I guess. Myth busted. There's a myth that the first shotgun perk doesn't work on every single shotgun. It's not supposed to increase the headshot damage, but the heisted breacher shotgun apparently does. And it goes from a 185 headshot to a 231 headshot. And I know Epic doesn't know about this or they would have already fixed it. But this actually makes another shotgun, the Kit's Charge Shotgun, insanely broken, allowing it to hit a 195 fully charged body shot, which is the highest body shot damage a shotgun could ever do in Fortnite. Is there a creepy Peely Shrine on the Season 4 map? Yeah, apparently there is. And there's all these eaten bananas around the shrine. I don't know what's going on. Is Peely eating bananas? I don't want to think about it anymore. Myth confirmed. Can you place down invisible C4 in season four? So if you have a fully built metal wall, this part of the wall will actually hide the C4 behind it. So this is going to be a really great way to catch people off guard without revealing that you have C4. Is there a way to reset your turret's health? So yeah, you can just pick it up and then redeploy it and it's going to spawn back in with full health. But will an EMP grenade disable a C4? I feel like it should. All right, go ahead. No, it doesn't. Myth busted. Does the EMP nade cancel zip lines? No, it actually just bounces right off. Okay, everyone has been dying to know this. What happens if you're riding a gas can and drop on top of a tire? Okay, the moment everyone's been waiting for. Let's drop down. You somehow take damage from the gas canister. I didn't even know you could do that. This is a weird one. Did Epic secretly buff Steamy Springs? I remember last season, you would heal like one health every second in these springs, and it was extremely slow. But it seems like in this season, it heals faster and it gives you shield. You can actually go all the way up to full health, full shield off of Steamy Springs. I don't know if they did that on purpose, but that's really good to know. Can you break one of these breakable walls with the Crash Pad Junior? No, you can't. Actually, you can't break anything with the Crash Pad Junior, unlike the original Crash Pad. Can you safely launch using a rocket ram without putting yourself in danger? Now, there's always danger when you're flying through the air, but if you want to be protected with some builds before you fly, all you have to do is phase into your cone by standing in an awkward angle. And then once you see it yellow, you initiate the rocket ramp. 
going to break all the builds around you and then you can crouch into the cone and be protected by someone trying to beam you or snipe you while you're charging up can two people steal a vault mythic at the same time now i've tried this and it doesn't work but what if you get the timing exactly right three two one go no bro come on you can't can you use a fishing rod to fish the mythics out of the vault did you guys actually think that was gonna work come on now <laughs> can you use a rocket ram to fly through this statue i mean i feel like they want you to they have a little opening but is it enough for us to fit through here we go and no you just break the whole statue we tried is the deboot van actually in game i've seen a lot of memes and people talking about it before the season dropped but is it in game yet wait it is it's just a reboot van but it looks different why did they call it the deboot van i think this is just for challenges myth confirmed are there ghost builds around relentless retreat what is this i guess so there's certain spots that have like these invisible builds that are connecting to whatever is floating which kind of sucks there's a lot of places you can't build in the new season what happens if you drop a turret onto a hop flower it'd be cool if it just keeps bouncing and okay it bounces but it bounces off and then it activates if you're already falling can you use a crash pad to save yourself all right and yes you absolutely can so the crash pad junior is probably one of the most useless items this season but we found a way to make it a little more useful so if you put it on the ground and you slide into it you go with decent distance but if you slide and then throw it on the ground you actually end up going a little further still kind of useless but it's good to know all right guys that was fortnite season four myths this season has been amazing and hopefully you guys learned something but don't go using that chun li glitch thank you guys so much for watching